What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I want to talk about and tell you guys how you can actually obtain the Prison of Elders primary weapons with elementary damage. Now a lot of you guys probably don't know this and some of you may, you can actually obtain the Prison of Elders primary weapons with elementary damage just like you get those from the Trials of Osiris from that lighthouse chest that have elementary damage. The same thing works with the Prison of Elders weapons. Now before today, I had no idea how you actually obtain these things. A lot of people thought that you would be able to buy them from Valix the Loyal, which is not the case. The only weapons he sells primary wise do not have elementary damage. In today's video, I can showcase to you guys my friend actually obtaining this, telling us how you actually obtain these weapons. Now my mate got the Prison of Elders Pulse Rifle, the Aegis of the Cow 2 and the 2 is there because that represents that this weapon has the elementary damage. The 6 Dreg Pride 2 will have elementary damage and so will the Wolf Slayer's Claw 2. Now he obtained this weapon when we beat Skolas in the level 35 Prison of Elders Arena. That motherfucking art damage fight. So, so, so difficult, but we got there in the end. And he got this Aegis of the Cow 2, which, like I said, is an elementary void damage push rifle. Now, this is obtainable from Valix the Loyal. He will eventually bring it to sell, and you can probably obtain it from a Judgment Chance package, but you won't get elementary damage on it. These, I'm afraid, I think only drop from the level 35 Prison of Elders arena. Now, if you guys have obtained these from other difficulties in the Prison of Elders, be sure to let me know down below in that comment section and let everybody else know. But as far as I know, and I've done a lot of research into trying to find out how we get these weapons, and there's absolutely nothing on the internet, apart from people reporting that they're getting it from the level 35 Prison of Elders, just like my friend did. Now we can see on screen now, this full rifle, like I said, it's a 365 attack void damage primary weapon called Aegis of the Cow 2. We're gonna go through its mods as well. These, unfortunately though, are not reforgeable, as we all know the Prison of Elders and the Trials of Osiris weapons are not. Its sights, we have Quick Draw IS, we then have Red Dot ORS, we have Focus Lens FLA5, we then have Range Finder. Aim in this weapon increases its effective range. We then have Extended Mag, a larger magazine. We have Fitted Stock, increases weapon stability. And we have Flared Magra, reload this weapon even faster. And final perk we have is called Vandal Burn. This weapon deals moderate bonus damage to fallen vandals. So not bad whatsoever. It's gonna be one to use in that prison of elders it really is. Now I'm not sure how many Fandals I've seen that do have void shields, but still nonetheless, it's the best of both kinds really. But yep guys, this is how I believe you do obtain the second versions of the prison of elders primary weapons. I believe they drop from the level 35 prison of elders arena. But like I said, if you have obtained one of these weapons another way, be sure to let me know down below in that comment section. There is a few Prison of Elders primaries. There's a Scout Rifle, the Orsal Rifle, which is the Wolf Slayer's Claw. We have the Six Dread Pride, which is the Hand Cannon. We have the Agis of the Cow, which is the Pulse Rifle. And as far as I know, that is it. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for stopping by as always. Do drop a like, I do appreciate the support. And peace out until next time. Peace!